Welcome back to White Mountains Today. I'm your host, Wendy Howell, and joining me again from the Christmas loft is our dear friend, Greg Vanderveer. Merry Christmas, Wendy. Merry Christmas. It's not too early, is it? No. no. I feel like I have a right to say Merry Christmas I now. I think so. Yeah. All day yesterday, I'm like, I want to put my tree up. <laughs> and I, I want to put the tree and up. And why didn't you? My kids weren't home from school. Yeah. I just had to wait. I can't do it without and them. And you were telling me, how many trees do you have? I have two big trees. How do you decorate them? Um, one is all like family, family ornaments. ornaments yeah. Um, anything that was important to me or my husband, things that the kids have made. And then the other tree is all, <clears throat> I don't know, very organic. You know, I go and get the so red berries from like the beautiful. tree. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Popcorn good. and cranberries. and. We at the Christmas Off fully endorse two trees. We <laughs> even recommend that maybe you go to three, four, maybe five trees. Yes. You know? mm -hmm. well, I, I have 12 might be, too. 12 is probably the maximum. <laughs> But you, so you have some room to grow. I and have many, trees that are this big. And you decorate the little ones too. I have trees that are this big. <laughs> you're, I think you're on the right path. I think <laughs> you're on addicted. the right path. <laughs> I'm addicted. But I, I, it's all so cute. I love it. We brought a nice little collection for you. It's been, things are really looking good <laughs> at the Christmas loft. So we kind of spent all year getting our trees decorated mm -hmm. and getting the store filled. And this, there comes a point, and it was really this week where I'm walking around like, oh, okay, we're ready to go. Yeah. It's looking really good. Um, our staff has done a great job decorating the trees because every year around um, we have about 16 different theme trees mm -hmm. and they all get changed every year and it kind of like creates the mood of the whole store and the yeah. different product that we're selling and our manager Kelly Levesque um, she's a fairly new manager the, for the two years and this year she took on the the decorating of all the trees and she's done oh a terrific gosh. job Excellent. so it's really exciting to see it all come together and then at our other store North Woodstock our manager Jillian Parker does all the trees there nice. so they're actually they have their own different little style similar themes but they're both really beautiful Aww. so it's really fun to walk around and see it all and to ah. see it all come together so excited to kind of show it off and every day we're getting busier and busier and busier so well, I missed our annual October visit, so we're coming in November. <laughs> I think November is the time to come. I can't wait to see. It's actually our busiest there. month of the year. People would think it's December, but because November we have all month, people yeah. are buying all month. Yep. Where with December you kind of yeah. tails off a you're bit at the end. You're getting ready yeah. to decorate. You're getting ready. That's you're, right. People like you are going to put up the tree <laughs> any day. <laughs> any day now. I'll call you tomorrow. I think today is, is the day. <laughs> and I love the way all of the decorations look at the top of the store from the outside. I mean, I think you've like revamped that where the Santa is and the trees and just above the entrance on the outside. Yeah, and the outdoor thing. That. Yes, we have a Santa hanging from a pole. Yeah. I've heard him rudely referred to as stripper Santa because some people think oh. he's on a stripper pole. <laughs> so if you want to call him that, that's okay. But he's like up there, he's a huge Santa and we've lit up all those trees so we have a lot of our latest lights on that. So at nighttime when you drive by yeah. on our tower, it's really quite festive. And I'm in the process of putting up the outside lights. So I have that about halfway done as well. Nice. So we're, we're halfway there to get that all lit up. Oh, it's gonna be great. That's my biggest challenge is the outside lights because it's, like, it's, it's all me doing it. It's a lot. <laughs> no help, no <laughs> help at two all. Buildings. <laughs> <laughs> Show us what you've brought us today. <clears throat> so yeah, here we have a lot of stuff. We got Mickey Mouse here. He's really popular all over Disney. We actually had a Mickey this big as well, and I'm like, well, maybe that's a little much. So I brought in, I brought in this size Mickey, and we have small Mickeys too, but all of our Disney stuff is really good. He's dressed as Santa, mm -hmm. and he's, he's a possible dream collectible, so it's actually the same as the Santa and Mrs. Claus next to him. Oh, okay. You see that? And you see what they're doing? They we are. have about 20 or 30 different styles of this. And these ones are our wine ones. So they're actually smashing the grapes and drinking wine. They're having a great old time. That actually reminds me that Santa starting... This way? <laughs> it, won't, it won't be this Santa. It'll actually be the real Santa. He come, starts coming to our store on Friday after Thanksgiving. <gasps> and then he's there all that weekend from 10.30 to 3.30. And it's free pictures, so you can come and see him, and it's just free photos, talk Aww. to Santa, give him your list. And then he'll be exclusively at the Christmas Loft 
This is the real Santa that, that comes to us. Real, He's real. the real one. And so he'll be at the Christmas Off every weekend, Saturday and Sunday, 10.30 to 3.30, all the way up to the 23rd. Wow, that's very exciting. So that's a good reason to come along on those days. And we let you, you know, it's not a, tr it's not a formal photograph thing. Yeah. You just get to go up and take photos with Santa nice. and go along, you know, continue enjoying the store. Aw. Well, speaking of Disney, I see you have something oh, wait. Very sparkly I over there. I always forget. Okay. We got two hats here. <clears throat> We got the Irish hat and the hat, which is naughty Whichever or nice. Whichever one is smaller. I have an unusually small head. I think this one's smaller. Okay. <laughs> and I, I, so, I have a and this is the head. one. This is the one that. See, um, that's perfect. Whatever mood right. you're in, I guess I'll put on the naughty side. Green's my color. It's oh, good. good. It always really makes us look a lot better. I think I when think we so put too. the hats on. It makes my head look less pointy. It's <laughs> good. <laughs> what? Show us the Disney, um, the other Disney Oh, you one want the other Disney one? Yeah. So these are um, these facets from one of our big companies, Inesco. And so these, we have them in all of your favorite characters, Dumbo and Stitch and Mickey and Winnie the Pooh. And they're just these really co cool little shelf sitters that kind of catch the light and That's been great. really fun. They've been a really terrific. I'm very particular in where things are put. And one day last year, I walked in the store and they put it on this big case. And I'm like, that is the stupidest place I've ever seen them for. And I didn't have time to change it, and they sold like crazy. Isn't that so, and so they are still on that big case, mm -hmm. selling like crazy all the time. Well, and I they, can see how they would catch they're the really light cute. and yeah. really sparkle. They're really cute. They're good. Nice. Then we have these December diamonds. These are mermen, which are very popular with the ladies and some men. <laughs> and so it's a huge collection of different mermen dressed up. This one is dressed up in his Santa hat with his mistletoe and he seems to be dr sitting in a martini <laughs> cup. Pickling so himself. The, we have about 30 of those and the, the people, even if they don't buy them, people always get a kick out of that oh, ornament yeah. board because they're fun to look at. They're all different kinds doing funny things. That's funny. That one's a popular one. Very cute. And oh, this one's fun. Here we have a big collection of s'more ornaments. He goes with our food themes. We have a great peppermint candy tree this year, and this one is next to that. He's a, we have about 40 different s'mores doing fun things. He's in a s'more outhouse reading a book <laughs> while he sits doing his little s'more poo, and there's even a graham cracker <laughs> door. And That's adorable. <laughs> so if you ever wanted a s'more in an outhouse, then this is your, this this is is your, your chance to, to get it. <laughs> Only seen here, folks. <laughs> Okay, this one I just, I really love. I want you to talk about uh, this one. Because yes. this is, the, what so was the other one? The pea in the pod? Yeah, that's pepper over shaker. there. Oh, the pea in the pod. Cards. And this one is from um, Christmas Vacation. So the, the uh, Chevy Chase film. And it's the classic scene where he gets the tree and then drives under the truck. And so that's a little it's salt magnetic. and pepper on it. So we actually have a bunch, they sell fast. We have a bunch of National Lampoon Christmas Vacation stuff from That's the houses and uh, the, the different villages and, and stockings. So if you're a big <laughs> fan of those movies or movies like Christmas Story, we have a lot of those things. I just love that it's a pepper shaker. It's cool. And the magnetic paper shakers are the best because mm -hmm. then it's like, ooh, it's fun. Yeah, I agree. I like Shoot them. as a button. Oh, oh here's know. this one, which you kind of nailed it when you said before. You're saying that he had a big butt? He's got back. Yeah, he's. he's oh! Oh my god. <laughs> my daughter would just get a kick out of that. <laughs> he's good. You did a very oh good job my there. Goodness. That was an excellent performance. I gotta give the He's dog, pretty though. good. I think you might have stole the show. <laughs> <laughs> I was oh, a little worried Lord. to bring him on because I didn't want to outperform <laughs> me, but <laughs> <laughs> too late. <laughs> so this is part of our gnome tree. We have a really cool kind of Scandinavian gnome tree this year, and this is actually a, what we call tree picks. So you can put them on the top of the tree or throughout the tree. So we have a hole in our store. We have from elegant different tree picks to kind of cute ones like this. It's adorable. So if you're kind of, it's a great place to come if you want to just figure out, you want to do a fun wreath or something different with your tree. We have so many different things and this yeah. is this is something you can go cute or elegant because with our trees we have all different styles. I love that. It's a good one. It's soft. It's really very, very well made. 
Yeah, it's cute. cute. Only the best quality of, of the course. Cursive cloth. Of course. Oh, and then I think I bring one before, but this is important to remember because this is a big tradition. Mm -hmm. So these are what we call our personalized ornaments, and we have uh, hundreds to choose from, and with different size families. So this would be a family of four. Yep. So you can, you know, put you put the names on each one, and the family name, and the year, and we have um, people with great calligraphy, and we have a whole. A workshop set up and you can come there and you buy the ornament and it's free for them to put all the names on so that's a really popular service that we provide this time of year all year round but this time of year yeah. it's super popular we've got a few of these yeah so but it's really fun I think fun I was saying before is that every year we come and we get a family yeah. ornament and it's gone from the two of us to three to four. So when you you're know, I think tree, we go up to twelve, so you have room to grow. We're gonna stay right <laughs> with the three, four. The four is good. Okay. <laughs> we're happy with our little family of four. No, but it's it's nice when you're looking at you're sitting and you're looking at your tree, and you just watch as the years have gone by and how your family has changed. And it's a big part of Christmas. It is a big part of Christmas. Yeah. It's what. And it's it's actually what makes being in the store this time of year is so special for me because you just hear everyone sharing those stories right. and you hear you know parents come in like oh I came in as a kid and now I bring a kid and we're even almost so long that we have grandparents who came oh in gosh. as a kid and now they are bringing their own grandkids so it's just that history of coming here and collecting your ornaments and mm -hmm. then bringing them back home and right. it makes it really special and when I'm I love the store all year round, but this time of year it starts to feel really exciting because yeah. you can really feel when people come in. It's what yeah. they want. They really want to mm -hmm. get into the Christmas spirit and they come to us for that. Absolutely. So it's exciting. Yeah. It is. Well, can I say thank just you. One, one little thing about um, we have, I told you about the Santa, and then we have, uh, I'm part of the White Mountain Indep Independence, which is a yep. great retail group of all the independent businesses. And we have um, a great thing coming up. So on Friday after Thanksgiving, we yes. call it Plaid Friday. So we're not into the other names. So this okay. is about supporting local, not big box stores, shopping yep. small. And there's a lot of great stores. And we all are gonna have um, really cool plaid scarves that, you, that we're getting from Ragged Mountain. So you come in, and you different promos but you basically get a plaid scarf for us if you spend a, over a hundred dollars you get these really nice locally made plaid scarves so that's a and great, while supplies last that's so that's really a good different. thing to think of you know come to the christmas loft shop all your local stores it's a it's a great time of year to kind of see what we're all doing out there absolutely way to support the community yeah it's fun that it's is fun, fun. I'm, i like my local small businesses i do too well thank you very much greg for coming and sharing all that you do and all merry, that you have yeah merry christmas we got one more show before Christmas That's time. That's right. We're going right, to really well, decorate this place out for that show. We're going to. <laughs> Happy holidays. Get in, in the Christmas spirit and come to the Christmas loft. You're watching White Mountains today.